Tesla is betting high on the development of its humanoid robot, Optimus. According to Elon Musk, the company aims to produce thousands of units later this year, mainly aimed at internal testing at Tesla's own facilities. If all is planned, the expectation is to multiply this production by 10 next year, with ambitious goals to manufacture between 50,000 and 100,000 robots. And that is just the beginning. Musk made it clear that the pace of production could accelerate even more in the coming years. One of the most surprising aspects of this project is the cost. Each Optimus unit is being produced for about $10,000. Musk also revealed that there will be different versions of the robot, allowing customers to choose models that better meet their needs and budgets. Far from being an isolated experiment, Optimus is being molded to become a key piece in the generation of Tesla's future profits. The company intends to use it widely on its assembly lines in the Texas, Fremont, and Shanghai factories. With the potential to scale production to hundreds of thousands of units, Optimus can become one of the pillars of Tesla's operation and boost the company towards an estimated $25 trillion market assessment. But after all, what can a $10,000 humanoid robot do? In a recently released video that caught the attention of the technology and robotics industry, Optimus appears facing rugged and muddy terrain, climbing and coming down hills in a totally autonomous way. And this is not a staging. The displayed movement is real, controlled by advanced artificial intelligence. Musk pointed out that the robot uses sophisticated neural networks to control the body all in real time, not just isolated parts. Think of Tesla's Cybertruck, but in robot form, resistant, adaptable, and prepared to face hostile environments. Even more impressive is the fact that Optimus is not being operated on remotely. Each step, each equilibrium adjustment after a slide is performed independently. The robot operates blindly without Tesla vision technology, relying only on internal sensors and neural processing itself to stand on unstable land. In the video, you can clearly see the robot reacting instinctively, stretching the leg to avoid a fall, adjusting the arms to maintain balance, and recalibrating their movements in real time. This level of autonomy is a remarkable advance and can, in the future, overcome even other Tesla bets such as electric vehicles, energy storage systems, and autonomous steering technology. And that is just the beginning. Elon Musk and his team have already confirmed that improvements are on their way. Optimus will receive updates that will improve their vision, make their movements more natural, and streamline their responses to human commands. Next versions will also have greater ability to recover from falls and adapt to more complex situations. With each new evolution, Optimus is no longer just a technological innovation to becoming a powerful tool with the potential to transform whole sectors. We are not just facing a robot. We are witnessing the birth of a new era for robotics and artificial intelligence. It is worth remembering that in the past, Optimus has been criticized for its slowness even being comically compared to politicians famous for its slow pace. But this is about to change. Musk has announced that a major hardware update is scheduled for this year to significantly improve robot speed. With these improvements, Optimus raises speeds up to 6 to 8 km slash HA considerable leap compared to its current performance. This update includes improvements in structure, engines, joints, sensors, and battery system. Tesla's goal is to make Optimus not only faster, but also more agile and prepare to deal with different types of terrain much more efficiently. And speed, of course, is just one of Tesla's goals for this visionary project. Tesla is making a significant leap in the development of the hands of the Optimus robot, folding its movement capacity from 11 to impressive 22 degrees of freedom. For the purpose of comparison, Many competing robots operate with only five or six. This advancement in dexterity can allow Optimus to perform extremely accurate tasks, such as folding clothes, sticking a line in a needle, playing musical instruments, or even acting in delicate areas such as medicine or manufacturing. This new generation of the robot's hands can put Tesla in leading the race for functional robotics. But the improvements don't stop there. The company is also investing heavily in improving Optimus's language capacity. With microphone and speaker embedded in the head, 
The robot will be able to interact much more fluidly and naturally, going far beyond conventional virtual assistants, such as Apple's Crab. Imagine showing a recipe video for Optimus. It will be able to learn the process instantly and prepare the plate alone. This kind of contextual learning will make the robot a true ally in domestic and professional environments, performing tasks with little or no supervision. With this level of sophistication, Tesla is not just trying to accompany competitors, it is clearly trying to redefine what is possible in the universe of humanoid robotics. The third generation of Optimus will come with a complete reformulation in design. Tesla is leaving aside heavier metals such as aluminum and adopting state of the art materials such as carbon fiber and polycarbonate. This change promises to reduce the weight of the robot, increasing its agility and movement capacity without compromising its resistance or stability. And when will we see this new model in action? The latest statements indicate that Tesla is already preparing for a large scale production. Elon Musk has revealed that the company intends to manufacture thousands of units soon, suggesting that Optimus may begin to be commercially distributed in the coming months. Although Musk has not yet specified an exact number for production, his comments suggest a goal of at least 10,000 units, more than much more. Initially, the production was focused on Giga Texas focused on the first generation of the robot. But as 2025 advances, it seems that efforts are now focused on an improved Gen 2 version or even the release of Gen 3, according to the latest updates recently released. This year only, there are rumors that Tesla intends to produce between 20,000 and 40,000 units of the Optimus robot. And looking at 2026, Elon Musk has already signaled a considerable increase on this scale, with goals that can reach 50,000, even 100,000 robots per year. And that is just the beginning. The expectation is that this production will grow rapidly in the following years, possibly multiplying for 10 annually. Given this scenario, Musk's bold prediction that Optimus can lead Tesla's market value to impressive $25 trillion begins to seem less utopian. Of course, not everyone is convinced. Many still face these estimates with skepticism and raise concerns about replacing human jobs. However, History shows that automation, rather than eliminating jobs, tends to transform them. Robots like Optimus have the potential to take people out of dangerous, repetitive, or physically exhaustive tasks, allowing them to dedicate themselves to activities that require creativity, strategic thinking, and specialized skills. Instead of competitors, these machines often become work partners. Giga Texas, in turn, has already shown that it has the ability to face this challenge. The factory produces about 250,000 Model Y units per year and has been setting up for Cybertruck for over a year, with the objective of exceeding 2,000 units per week by 2025. With this already in operation knowledge and infrastructure basis, including Optimus in the production line is a logical and viable movement. Tesla's investment in Giga Texas has been gigantic. $775 million has been applied to the expansion of the plant, including new factories and areas dedicated to production. Among these structures are specific lines for batteries and main components of vehicles, all concentrated in a single complex. The Optimus Mass Production Foundation is already being built. In addition, the support of local and community authorities has been fundamental to this growth. The Austin region offered tax incentives and substantial benefits, which allowed Tesla to expand with agility. These factors were crucial in choosing Giga Texas as a production center, and success in manufacturing Model Y and Cybertruck only reinforces this decision. Another Tesla strategic step is the way Optimus will be made available to the public. According to recent internal information, the company is preparing a leasing program that should be launched in the early months of 2025. Musk has already confirmed that the robot will be offered for both purchase and rent, although the lease should have initial priority. This approach makes a lot of sense. Leasing allows consumers to test the robot at a lower initial cost without immediately shelling the total amount, which is around $20,000. For many, it is a way to evaluate and practice how Optimus can be useful in your daily life before you make the decision to buy. It is an intelligent strategy to make advanced robotics more accessible 
and less intimidating to the general public. This Tesla's initiative has the potential to make the Optimus robot accessible to a much broader audience, especially for small businesses and individuals who operate with more limited budgets. This is just a piece within the company's most ambitious plan, making robots humanoids something common in everyday life. Elon Musk's view is clear. He believes Optimus can be extremely useful and at the same time having an affordable price, with applications that go far beyond factories, even to people's homes. With an estimated price between $20 and $30,000, Tesla intends to reduce production costs to around $10,000 per unit. Not only does this guarantee a significant profit margin, but also allows the company to reach a much broader consumer base. But the real challenge is not just about making the robot for a low cost. It is to conquer millions or even billions from buyers worldwide. The big question is, how does Tesla intend to achieve this level of efficiency when so many companies in the industry still fight to lower their costs? In today's market, humanoid robots with similar abilities usually cost at least $80,000, which makes production largely difficult. This has been the main obstacle to many projects. A striking example is Atlas from Boston Dynamics. Despite being one of the most famous robots in the world, Atlas was never massive, even after almost a decade of development. In the end, the high cost and the difficulty of scaling production ended up leading to its discontinuation. Tesla, on the other hand, is adopting a completely different approach. In just two years, the company has quickly advanced by three versions of the Optimus robot. Musk has already announced that the final version will be presented later this year, with a modern design and features that can redefine the pattern of humanoid robotics. This rapid pace of development follows the same line that Tesla has already shown in the automotive industry, where she proved to be able to scale her operations efficiently. Reaching the production goal for $10,000 per robot may seem bold, but it is within the scope of Tesla. The company has consolidated experience in simplifying processes, integrating its production chain vertically, and taking advantage of economies of scale and is now applying the same know-how to robotics. While other companies such as Boston Dynamics have faced difficulties in turning innovation into commercial product, Tesla is taking advantage of the base that is already built on its electric vehicles. Parts such as batteries, electric motors, sensors, cameras, and actuators, many of them used in the brand's own cars, are being adapted for use at Optimus. As the company manufactures most of these components internally, it can maintain cost control and optimize its production efficiently. Tesla's great differential in the humanoid robotic sector is an in intelligent fusion between her experience with electric vehicles and the application of this technology to robots. By taking advantage of systems and components already developed internally, the company can create Optimus with costs far lower than those of competitors. And with the enormous production capacity of Texas Gigable, Tesla is clearly positioning itself to have a deep impact on the industry, offering a powerful, functional, and, above all, accessible robot on a scale never seen. The key to this advance is Tesla's ability to optimize processes and drastically reduce manufacturing costs. During the second quarter of 2024 results conference, Elon Musk went straight to stating that the company is leading the humanoid robot sector. He left no doubt. It's not just another competitor. Tesla is defining the pattern. According to Musk, no other company comes close to what Tesla has gained in terms of mass production and technological sophistication in this area. He also pointed out that Tesla already has everything that is needed to manufacture highly functional robots on a large scale from infrastructure and central technology to production know-how. This is precisely what most companies have not yet been able to develop. For this reason, Musk's ambitious plan to sell Optimus for about $10,000 begins to seem increasingly viable. Tesla's advantage is in her consolidated experience and the structure she has built over the years. Since 2022, Musk has reinforced the goal of launching Optimus with a starting price of around $20,000. And over time, it is evident because the company is so focused on this value. The goal is not just to sell robots, it's to master the market before anyone can approach. 
By adopting an aggressive price strategy, Tesla aims to quickly win a solid base of users and ensure their leadership before competitors have time to react. What makes Optimus so interesting is its cost and performance relationship. Although it does not completely replace a human being in all tasks, estimates indicate that the robot can perform between 50 and 60 distinct functions, and all for less than $30,000. This balance puts it in a unique category, without direct competition in terms of cost-effectiveness or return on investment. Musk has mentioned several times that the final price should vary between $20 and $30,000, and there is even evidence that Tesla's future robotaxi may have a similar price range. If these advanced technologies are made available at a cost comparable to that of a common car, the impact on the market can be gigantic. Recently, in a publication on the X platform, former Twitter, Musk acknowledged that both Optimus and CyberCab could eventually cost around $60,000. But this would only happen if mass production was reached. And there is the crucial point. The higher the volume of manufacture, the lower the costs, allowing these futuristic products to become accessible to the general public.